a look at question number four from the 2013 um, revised tire physics paper. It says that two blocks are linked by a Newton balance of negligible mass right here. The blocks are on a frictionless uh, level surface and a force of 18 newtons is applied to the blocks as shown. The reading on the Newton balance is. So what we're looking at here is the effectively the force required to pull um, the four kilogram mass. So the first way to look at this problem is to determine what is the acceleration on the entire system of the six kilogram and the four kilogram and the Newton balance of negligible mass. Uh, so to do that we're going to use Newton's second law F is equal to m a. So the unbalanced force is 18.0 newtons and that's applying a force on the entire system which has got a mass of 10 kilograms or 10 yeah 10 kilograms no point zero um, we're, we're thinking of two sig fig here so I'll try and just rub out the um, decimal point there and then um, that's multiplied by the acceleration which we're trying to determine so therefore our acceleration is 18 divided by 10 which is evidently 1.8 meters per second squared so now we consider that this mass here will be accelerating at 1.8 meters per second squared so we can determine the force required to do that or the unbalanced force required to do that and um, so that's the force um, on the 4 newton um, sorry not 4 newton 4 kilogram mass um, I'll do that right on the 4 kilogram and that's equal to its mass which is 4 times its acceleration which is 1.8 and that gives us a value of 7.2 newtons so that's the force which is acting in this direction on that mass 7.2 newtons um, and that's the only force that's acting on this mask because it's on a frictionless surface and so therefore that is the reading on the Newton balance and just to uh, clarify that that's also the force which is pulling back in this direction um, on the six kilogram mass because if we think about the six kilogram mass on its own um, it's needing a force um, of its mass times its acceleration um, which is 1.8 as well I'll just write that clearly and that's an unbalanced force of 10.8 newtons and so if you think about it if there's 18 newtons being pulled forward and 7.2 newtons in reverse um, then that's an unbalanced force of 10.8 newtons as well which is another way to consider the problem okay I hope you find that helpful